YouTube, Germinator5280 here with a model review of a Delta Airlines McDonnell Douglas MD90. Delta. So, here's the boom start off of the box. We have a very typical Germinator's box. I'm not going to go through all the details on it. A picture of the plane, Delta, you know. Here's a story. Um, pause it if you'd like to read it. Then we got some information about the aircraft. Been flying since August or June 1995. Excuse me. Uh, there's some pictures. You got the bubble where the aircraft is. Not too interesting. We got the box. And then on the back, we have the typical back. And this is a Boeing official licensed product. Now let's get to the plane. The great part. This is one of my favorite models in my entire collection, so I'm getting a review of it. So, I really, really like this model. I got it, um, I think about a month and a half ago, and it's just phenomenal. I love this plane. I do have it due routes and all my up, and whenever I'm in my airport around, I try to get a guy, get it in it. Um, I absolutely love it. I think it's got phenomenal detail. No antennas, but still phenomenal detail, and for such a small plane, I mean, we're to have all this detail. So, let me get into the review. I'm going to start off here at the front of the plane. We have our cockpit windows and the eyebrows. And then we have a little uh, probe and a little uh, thing here. I don't really know what it's called. It's really nice. Then we have our um, L1 boarding door with the Sky Team logo. Lots of detail on the door and some self-contained stairs here. The Delta logo and our windows. As we go back, the wings are pretty far back on this plane as it is a. It does. It does have the any fuselage mounted turbo fans. Um, great, great, great and, uh, wing detail. Excuse me. Our two uh, doors and then our American flag registration is N nine zero one DA. November nine zero one Delta Alpha. Then we have our little catering, which used to be catering. Now it's just an emergency exit door. Then we have our engines. We got the what kind of engines does it have on here? It has IAE V twenty fives. Very nice, great detail. I think the detail on these engines is just phenomenal. We got our T tail. Love T tail planes. Let's go to the bottom. The other side's the same. We'll go. We'll get a couple of views of it at the end. Starting at the front, we have our uh, nose gear doors, and it, this does have nose nose cone detail as well. Nose gear. Um, and then we have our Delta Blue, and then two bag loading in the front and one in the back. German Dutch logo, sand hole, rolling landing gear, rubber. Um, even these come out on the bottom, the detail on the wings, I think it's just phenomenal. I really love this plane. And here we have our self-contained stairs in the back for emergencies, which they do put down at some airports. And then the bottom of the T-tail. Bottom of the engines, and then here is the Right hand side of the plane, just like the left, but kind of in reverse. We got a smaller catering door and the Sky Team logo not on it. So that is going to conclude the review of the McDonnell Douglas McDonald Douglas MD90. It does have rolling gear. I really like this plane. Definitely recommend it if you can find it. Um, I paid, I got it for like thirty bucks on eBay. Um, it was worth every penny of it, and um, definitely recommend it. So like. Comment and subscribe, give me a thumbs up, and uh, we'll see you in another review. We should have five to seven more today. Thank you, and uh, see you later.